Welcome back to your daily video announcements. I'm Gunnar Pulliam. And I'm Caden Barnhart. Here, are some, here is some info on prom. This year's prom theme is Starry Night Prom 2021. It's Saturday, April 10th, 8 p.m. B29 Dock Hanger. VCHS juniors and seniors only. Purchase tickets in Miss Cooper's room, C48, until Thursday, April 1st. Here is some information on the blood drive. Hi, I'm Claire Bachman, and April 1st, we will be hosting a blood drive during school. You do have to be 16 years old, but the Red Cross is offering anyone under 18 who donates blood a $10 gift card. It's a great chance to get out of class and help save a life. Contact me or Mr. Mosley for information. Now, let's go to weather with Ryan Goble. Welcome back to your daily weather forecast for today. It's going to be sunny and windy with a high of 72 with the winds to the south of 25 to 35 miles an hour. Winds could occasionally gust over the 50 miles an hour. Tonight it's going to be windy with a few clouds from time to time with a low of 46 with the winds to the south southwest at 20 to 30 miles an hour with higher wind gusts possible. That's all for weather. Now back to you guys in the studio. Here are today's holidays. Welcome back to your top five news stories of the day. Number one, Biden pledges 200 million vaccine doses in 100 days in first solo press conference. Number two, Georgia enacts sweeping voting restriction bill. Number three, Suez Canal blockage could re repeatedly last weeks. Number four, severe weather rocks the south with multiple tornadoes and high winds. And number five, sharks seen swimming in tank on interstate in Baltimore. That's all. March 29, 1951. In New York, Julius and Ethel Rosenberg are convicted of conspiracy to commit espionage for passing nuclear secrets to the Soviet Union. They die in the electric chair two years later, the first American civilians to be executed for espionage. 1971. Army Lieutenant William Calley, Jr. is convicted of murdering Vietnamese civilians in the My Lai Massacre during the Vietnam War. Correspondent Morgan Beatty. The charges, at least 22 unarmed and unresisting South Vietnamese men, women, and children were slain at My Lai in 1968. Calley ends up serving three and a half years under house arrest at his quarters at Fort Benning, Georgia. 1973, the last U.S. combat troops leave South Vietnam, ending America's direct military role in the Vietnam War. Two years later, South Vietnam, including its capital, Saigon, falls to North Vietnamese forces. And 2005, if it doesn't fit, you must acquit. Attorney Johnny Cochran dies in Los Angeles at age 67. Cochran was best known for his successful and controversial defense of O.J. Simpson during his murder trial. Today in History, March 29th, Sandy Kozell, The Associated Press. Welcome back to your daily video announcements. I'm Gunnar Pulliam. And I'm Caden Barnhart. Here, are some, here is some info on prom. Here is some information on the blood drive. Now, let's go to weather with Ryan Goble. Now, let's take a look at our top five news stories. Here are today's holidays. That's all.